Hey guys, Bloggle Gaming. Um, I thought I'd just do a little quick video. I don't normally do this kind of stuff on things like Call of Duty, Halo, um, stuff like that. I Ultimate Team, I don't touch. Um, but I thought Gears, such a good game. I'll give them a bit of money. I'll put a money in, bit of money in the back pocket and I'll treat myself to some operations packs. Now, these ones contain either emblems or weapons or characters plus random cards including bounties, skills and things like that. So I have decided that I will buy five. I will open five. Um, that is all I'm going to open. But I will just warn you that if you're watching this without playing the campaign, there could well be spoilers. May even be spoilers for me. If I unlock a character that I don't know about or didn't know was alive or dead or whatever, it's not my problem. I'm sorry, but I'll ruin it for myself as well as you guys. Okay? Let's go straight in. We'll open the packs. So they open up. It's an operations pack. We'll open the first one. You get five cards. You can tell what they're going to be by scrolling over the colour of them. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to reveal all. I'm going to reveal one by one as well. So my first card is a versus bounty. Get a thousand scoring guardian. I get two thousand XP. The next card, executions. Get five executions. Get five thousand. Get. Sorry, I wish it was five thousand XP. Get a thousand XP. So these are like burn cards in Titanfall where you can uh, gain things. A bit like boost as well in um, Halo. Turret cost. Turret cost less for you to build. Well, that'll come in handy when I use an engineer, I guess. That will come in handy in Horde. Oh, it's purple. Zombie Mark skin Mark 1. That's nice. It's a nice skin. Nice skin. This one will be another standard. Uh, it's a scout skill, so health boost, you have more health when you play as a scout skill. Okay, the bad first draw. In the next pack. Go straight in with the first one. Versus bounty, king of the hill score, so I get 1,500 scoring king of the hill, and I learn uh, 3,000 XP. I'm obsessed with 5,000 XP. The next card, probably going to be another versus bounty. Oh, no, it's an emblem, swarm knight. Very nice. Horde bounty, XP, so kill 50 enemies, 2000 XP, and obviously the XP will go towards your leveling up, so that's, that's handy. Explosive launcher capacity, your, your explosive launchers carry more ammo. Well, I'm guessing that's a heavy skill, that's good. Versus bounty, get 10 headshot kills, I'm assuming that's in a match. Maybe across several matches, I'll look into that. 2500 XP. Okay, next pack. I'm looking for a character. I really want a character or a skin. First card. Sniper skill. Precision rifle capacity. Your precision rifle carries more ammo. That's good. Next card is engineer skill. Weapons locker cost. Weapons lockers cost less for you to build. That's going to be handy in horde mode again. Blue. Skin outside the snub. Snub pistol. Soldier skill, grenade capacity, plus one grenade. And again, five headshot kills, 1000 XP. So that's probably more likely than the 10. So we've got two packs remaining, so this one and one more. XP. Uh, executions, get 10 executions, 2000 XP. Heavy skill, and again, another launch capacity, so I'm sure that will come in handy. Burge bounty, get 10 assists. I'm more likely to get assists than I am kill, so that will probably be one that I'll chuck on at the start. Burge bounty, you have 1,500 score in Guardian, 3,000 XP. Now, you're supposed to get a character, an emblem, or a skin in every pack. So far I have, so the last one is a purple. Oh, now for that character. Yes! V-Day Gear. So that's the uh, it's the female V-Day Gear Cog uh, that I can play as as a character. So the last pack. Two out of five. Not too bad, I suppose. I preferred more than one, but... Blue as our first. Heavy skill. Ultra reload. Plus 10% reload speed. So that'll be handy. Green is going to be... Scout skill, pick up distance. Oh, so I can pick up from further away. See? That's those little uh, little diamonds that you get in Horde mode. 
escalation score, so get a thousand score in escalation, two thousand points, so that'll be one that I'll get over time. The other green. Okay, so team deathmatch score, get a thousand score in team deathmatch, two thousand XP. So the last one again, even though it's a green, should be a should be a skin or an emblem or a character. Though I imagine it will just be a skin. Yep, I'll take that urban long shot. Okay. Cheers, guys. That's that. I won't be any more uh, opening any more packs for a while. I'd like to, but the money is a waste in it. You know, got to weigh it up, weigh it up. I do like supporting the team, though. It's, uh, it's a good way of putting money back into the uh, into the games that you love. I'll give them that. So anyway, cheers, guys. I will be leaving with you. If you've watched this on Twitch, cheers. If you have uh, found it on YouTube, if you haven't already, give us a subscribe. Looking for 50 by Christmas. Cheers, man. Bye.